guys, it's me Charita and welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be a room tour video and this video is literally one of the most requested videos on my channel. I've already done a room tour for my previous apartment and I'll link that video right here. And I've also done an empty apartment tour for this particular apartment. I shifted into this apartment in August 2020 and I wanted to give you guys a room tour. So. To give a background about this room, I share this room with uh, one of my roommates and her bed is on the opposite side and I won't be showing her space for privacy reasons but I'll be showing you my space, the half side of the room and I'm super excited to show you guys everything and I've also done a DIY video for this particular room and I DIY'd this gallery wall that you see behind me and my style is not minimalist, it's more like colorful maximalist a little bit of clutter core basically I add everything that makes me happy and I add pieces that have a lot of storage cause student life and my wardrobe is ever flowing so I need a lot of storage pieces so I'm super excited to show you guys my room and without wasting any further time let's get started with the room tour the first thing that you see when you enter my room is my bed. I got the bed frame from Amazon and I also got the mattress from Amazon. This duvet is from Target and these cushions are the ones that I got from India. So I absolutely love my bed setup. It is so fun and colorful and it really makes me happy. Next to the bed, I have a bedside table that I literally got like 10 days ago and I found it the ground floor of the building and I have DIY'd this gallery wall that is just behind the bed. I've actually done a DIY tutorial on this and this is sort of the area that is next to my bedside table. On the other side of the bed is a laundry basket and few storage baskets and a storage box. I have upcycled a few pasta sauce bottles and mason jars to propagate cuttings of plants and they look so good and they add bits of greenery to the apartment. Coming to my bedside table setup, I have this beautiful hand painted plate that I thrifted from Goodwill which is like a catch all for my earrings and my hairbands and anything that I want next to my bed. In the first row of my bedside table, I keep essential things like my hand cream, Vaseline, lip balm, my charger and the book that I am currently reading. Coming to this portion, I have this little mini library set up next to my bedside table. So there's a wooden box that holds most of my novels and thicker novels go on the top. And I also have my journal and my daily planner next to it. And this candle is the one that I got from Target on sale and it literally acts as a book end and I feel really nice with scented candles around the apartment. I feel like they add some warmth and coziness in the apartment especially in winters so I'm just saving it for winter. Talking about other knickknacks that I have on my bedside table, I have a photo frame, I have an upcycled bottle that acts like a vase and I have a bonsai palm plant that I absolutely love and next to the gallery wall on the other side of the bed, I have another DIY mason jars that hold dried eucalyptus leaves and then there's this floating shelf that I also DIY'd that has a little hippo and few dried flowers. On the other side of the bed, next to the laundry baskets and the other storage baskets is the clothing rack. I have my cowboy boots on one of the storage boxes because it looks really good and aesthetic. This is the clothing rack that I got from Amazon for around $25 or $30 when I first came here. And believe me, it is one of the best investments that I've made. It kind of adds that fashion studio vibe to the room and it also acts as a decor element and you can switch out the clothes when the seasons change so it looks really cool in my opinion and it also forms the background for my videos next to the clothing rack i have this huge mirror that i actually garbage picked and it kind of elongates the room the room is really small and it gives an illusion of a bigger room and i absolutely love it i have few bottles with dried flowers and leaves in it it looks really good and this 
is the mirror that I thrifted from Goodwill for around 10 or 15 dollars and this mirror is literally chef's kiss. This amazing mirror that I found at Goodwill definitely deserves all the attention because it opens up and it has this amazing jewelry storage. It stores all of my and my roommates earrings, necklaces, nail paints and look at this it is the best storage ever and I literally got it for like $15 which is insane. This room has bay windows and I'm obsessed with the bay windows and it also has a tree in front of it so it has that greenery. Talking about this table, we garbage picked this table. It has that very aesthetic tile design going on and we use this table to work on, do our makeup, drink tea and it also holds most of our skincare and makeup so i have this little basket that i got from goodwill which has all my skincare and this storage box is also from goodwill that i think i got for three dollars i store all my makeup in the bottom drawer and the top part has most of my more expensive rings and earrings and gold chains and stuff like that so this is our cute little table and chair setup. I also have this little hanging plant. Cute little hearts on the window and these two crystals are actually rainbow crystals that I got from Amazon and when the light hits in the morning, it fills the whole room with tiny little rainbows that I absolutely love. This is my cozy, comfy, colorful room setup. I absolutely love this space. Everything in this space is either thrifted, garbage picked or DIY except for a few pieces from Amazon. And I did not have a lot of plants in my last apartment so I made sure I have plants in this one. And in case you like this video, you know what to do. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and let me know in the comments below what do you think my decor style is and I'll see you in my next video until then bye